right, here we go through episode 439. And I can't give you details because I don't want to spoil Lost for you, but there's an episode in season three of Lost involving football. So if you know you if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. And they end the episode with a basically a football throw and a football catch, and then a guy spikes it after he presumably scores a touchdown. Huge moment, uh, it, uh, like a big lip alligator moment. Like uh, the other characters are flabbergasted to see this, right? That's what the last episode reminded me. Of. <laughs> they ended the episode this way. They had the music rise and everything. They show him and he spikes football and everybody's like, "What the actual f?" <laughs> kind of where we're at. I think we're at that point in this series. <laughs> All right, you know where we are? You know where we're going. Three, two, one. Point being, I, I can't wait to see what happens next because this shit's wild as hell. Poison guy is definitely a damn problem, by the way. Venom Road was... Uh, for some reason, Venom Road is what's sticking with me. He can shoot out Venom and then he can travel along with it. Like, that is just a badass power. If I'm here... And there's a big courtyard, and I want to be on the other side of the courtyard upstairs. I can just shoot out some poison and travel Venom Road to get over to the other side. I just love that, man. Who thinks of that? Anybody can think of using Venom, you know, like I'm kicking these dog asses. <laughs> That's right. Woof, woof. But um, anybody can think of using Venom to attack people, like little Venom dragons going after people, biting them, whatever, poisoning them. But... Um, Sometimes there's extra exposition here, so I want to make sure I'm not missing anything. They'll be like a... The way they sum up something is not necessarily maybe the way I took something, so I like that. Good shit. But who would think of, like, using that to travel, right? Like, it's just nuts. Absolutely nuts. That's right. Break it down. Again, with the size difference of people. It's almost like there's two or three different races of people. Somewhere in the past, they branched off. One, they probably started tall. Some, one line of descent stayed tall the entire time. And the other two lines of descent, one got halfway between like the tallest people, like the giants, and normal-sized people. And then the third line like is the normal-sized people we see walking around. You know, five to six feet tall people. So we probably have five, six feet tall, 12 foot tall, and then the 30 foot tall people. This dude seems to be about tw the, one of the 12 foot tall versions. Because we're seeing it consistently enough that that has to be, like if we're going to get into the science of it, that has to be what's going on. <laughs> now I'm getting the energy of um, the New Year's Eve party and the shiny. <laughs> the dog costume is doing it for me. Yeah. You're in heaven. <laughs> That's right. How are we funding all this? This is a lot of prison cigarettes. Generating power, lights, refreshments, <laughs> costumes and makeup. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you seem to be on the older side. Maybe you shouldn't be getting so excited. <laughs> or you're trolling us. I assume you're joking. You're trolling us. Anything's possible. Word has gotten around. Yeah. Yeah. Put some respect in his name. <laughs> I like the tattoo, if that's what that is. Don't call me Candy. I like the horse chair. I don't know about Dookie. Yeah, okay. I was going to say. <laughs> Ha, 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 
What, are you horrified? Like, I thought this would be up your alley, man. Maybe it's just the unseriousness of it all. <laughs> What's your problem? I think this is another troll job. They're long lost friends or something. And so, uh, I guess this is uh, not a troll job. He seems serious. By the way, chances are he was always a queer, just saying. Sounds like a you problem. I mean, they're silver ball budget alone, man. <laughs> I still think you got a trick up your sleeve. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I thought. <laughs> this person seems like super powerful, but not serious whatsoever. Like in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> it's all about the trolling, baby. Unserious. Now, what's your gum gum power? Deathwink? Oh, shit. So, like an energy blast? You know, I wouldn't be serious either if I could just wink and do this. <clears throat> Jesus, you just killed that man. I mean, I'm cool with it, but, you know. <laughs> it's all about the trolling and the grinding. Hey, we're still dancing. No serious questions. I like the bunny rabbit. He ate that rebound, by the way. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. What did that do? Do you have more than one power? Damn. Oh, boy. You better apologize. Wow. I mean, transforming somebody against their will is not cool, but, you know, he was an asshole, so. <laughs> I like how psychotic everybody is. Like, nobody gives a shit. They're just, they're all about it. So, you got anything else to say? Man, this dude is huge, man. Just massive. I'm talking probably a thousand pounds, man. <laughs> like that dude's brain has been stuck in park for two minutes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everything is fluid. The guards have to know about this. I just think they don't want the, they don't want the drama, man. They're like that uh, bodyguard or, or security guard in the Batman series. You walk in the room, you see Batman searching the room, you just turn around and leave because you're not trying to get your ass whipped. But it's two powers, though. How is this associated with the death wink, right? How do you have two different powers? Does this mean you ate two different fruits? The two things don't seem connected, right?
I mean, you definitely need a bra. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Look, we got a problem. Maybe we should start working on. That's a question. Maybe you can pump uh, Luffy with some hormones or something. Can it be any hormones? Or is it just that one thing you can do? I wonder if he can do anything. He can drug you with anything he wants. Straw boy. <laughs> I think we're in good hands. Because you're awesome. Yeah. I kind of, I'm gathering that. The crowd seems a little psychotic. Oh, so he's already around. Is he already cured? Yeah, he is messed up, man. Jesus. <laughs> I'm not hearing him say shit. You've been causing chaos, man. Luck is part of it. I like to think luck is preparation meets opportunity, you know? Oh, okay, so here's where he asked for it. Man, those wolves are tearing his ass up. I suppose we'll send you a bill. Yeah. <laughs> yep, and I don't think you're a demon. We've seen some demons in human skin. Good shit. Oh, shit. Is he shitting out the poison? Like, what is that? Also, 10 hours? Yeah, we, we, we've gone from 26 to 16, right? We're down to 16 hours? I think they mentioned it last episode. It's been 10 hours, right? Don't show me what I can't have. Man, it's cold as hell down here. <laughs> friend who's a stilt walker. I don't believe the logistics of this. <laughs> you cannot go faster than these wolves, man. Yeah. They definitely do the Scooby-Doo thing again, by the way. <laughs> Maybe you can with wax stilts. I don't know. They're probably lighter. <laughs> Yeah, your fucking minds. Also, like, it would be so easy just to brush the snot ice off your nose. I, why don't you do that? I guess they're preoccupied, right? Ha, <laughs> dumbasses. Well, they're kibbles and bits now, that's for damn sure. Man, he's not having a good time in there. That was me when sliders got canceled. The exact same sounds being made. Jesus. What is happening in there? Damn. The hell is the chamber? 
Man, his brother's dead. His brother's dead in two days. What are you talking about? Man, there's got to be something faster than this. Jesus. Well, that's a shitty deal. He's here for a good time, not a long time. Well, then if it doesn't save my life, I want my 10 years back. So you're telling me there's a chance. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Don't get poisoned again. Wow. Have a nice trip. This trip's going to be a trip, ain't it? I don't think the florist was necessary. You could have just injected me. Jesus Christ. Bet people who hate needles hate this episode. Well, it's up to God now, I guess. Whatever the hell it is we worship. <laughs> he is messed up, man. And he's been doing that for the last 10 hours. My man does not have two days, man. <laughs> Who knew uh, Bon Iver was this sympathetic, by the way? Oh, shit. Jesus. Oh, we God damn. Wow. That does not sound good, man. I'd rather you didn't, man. Is this something we need to see? Hearing it's bad enough. He's in there dr calmly drinking a cup of tea. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, you didn't want to see that shit. <laughs> Everybody's so goddamn dramatic on this show. <laughs> what are we supposed to do here, man? It is what it is. Unbelievable. You need to calm down, man. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to knock you out. <laughs> there, I did something. You happy? <laughs> we call this an education. <laughs> Got to be strong, man. The God. That's a little weird. Interesting. Life's about more than dancing. Well, he know he definitely has an indomitable spirit. That's for damn sure. And he's doing for Ace, not even himself. He needs to recover twice as fast as anybody's ever recovered, ever. <laughs> I 
It's always been a little unclear how much time they spent together as brothers. I always assumed Ace left pretty early on in Luffy's childhood. How many hours? 16 hours. So, not another day and a half. Great. So, basically, if we take two days literally, then we would have been talking about 48 hours minus 10, 38 hours. He's going to be executed in 16 hours. I assume he's going to be transferred. He, he's, he was going to be moved to a separate place, a, the other place, the other facility, right? I thought. I was a little confused, but I thought was a Marine Ford or whatever, whatever the base is, the central location is where he's going to be executed. Meanwhile, he's at the prison. I'm assuming there's going to be a prisoner transport at some point, I think. I could be wrong about that. But yeah, I, I just think that... Um, He's just, you know, we know who he is. We know Luffy. He's going to rebound a lot faster than he's supposed to. But, man, the ticking clock's really starting to give me some anxiety. That's all I'm saying.